this session we're going to talk about proof of work what is proof of work how does proof of work actually work who are the participants for proof of work in bitcoin how does proof of work make bitcoin blockchain secure what are the various criticisms for bitcoins high energy usage to validate proof of work stick around and we shall discuss in this video let's talk about uh, proof of work so what is proof of work in bitcoin at a high level proof of work relies on the conversion of electrical energy into digital blockchain weight affording unforgeable costliness to proof of work blockchains like bitcoin and in the process driving an incentive structure that produces byzantine fault tolerant distributed network so a miner basically converts electricity into a cryptocurrency in the proof of work process so in proof of work miners compete against each other to validate transactions and get rewarded the probability of being selected to build the next block is linked to the computation power proof of work is one of the consensus mechanisms for achieving agreement on the blockchain network to confirm transactions and produce new blocks to the chain who are the participants for proof of work there are two participants a miner and a full node operator so who is a miner a miner is a participant who competes to solve to produce a next block and broadcast it to the network a full node operator hosts and synchronizes a copy of the entire blockchain on his computer who are miners miners are a market of participants who compete to solve to produce the next block and broadcast to the network which is produced every 10 minutes the winning miner each gets a block reward of 6.25 BTC and the transaction fees in the block additionally the blockchain is granted a form of real world value since miners are willing to convert not just fiat currency in the form of hardware but an actual resource into the production of BTC the second participant in a bitcoin POW validation is a bitcoin node. Uh in bitcoin network nodes fulfill a very important role. A node is a computer that is connected to other computers which follows rules and shares information. A full node is a computer in bitcoin's P2P network which hosts and synchronizes a copy of the entire blockchain. So nodes are essential for keeping cryptocurrency network running. There is a schematic diagram of full node shown above uh, which has the state of the chain the blocks database and the mempool you can also see the list of banned nodes and incorrect transactions and you can also see the there is an inbound node and an outbound node for block relay and other information a full node is a program that fully validates transactions and blocks Almost all the full nodes also help the network by accepting transactions and blocks from other full nodes validating those transactions and blocks and then relaying them back to the full further nodes The Bitcoin core software can be used to run a full node on your computer as you can see in the screenshot above Proof of work criticisms Proof of work has been criticized for its energy intensive design and low performance capacity for on-chain transaction execution but with some caveats for example the vast majority of bitcoins mining is produced with renewable energy and balancing the cost of energy expenditure with bitcoins overall value and wealth generation is a convoluted task regardless Proof of work is a significant innovation in computational and game theory design. 
Bitcoin's proof of work model is a security measure that is a confluence of game theory incentives, distributed computing and social consensus, market economics and cryptographic proofs. It is the innovation that empowers a blockchain to function with secure, sustainable, distributed consensus and Bitcoin's more than decade long existence is a profound proof of that. Bitcoin's energy usage is very well documented on Twitter. Just search for Bitcoin energy usage and you will see a lot of tweets posting about Bitcoin's uh, energy usage and carbon footprint. And there are also interesting charts which show that Bitcoin uses very little energy compared to the banking system and gold mining. See you guys in the next session. Uh, thank you very much.